Kruistal is located in Rotterdam, Holland, and was designed by Rem Koolhaas in conjunction with the Office of Metropolitan Architecture, also known as OMA. In 2000, Koolhaas won the Pritzker Prize, but not directly for his work in Rotterdam. The design process for the Kruistal began in 1987, and construction was completed in 1992. The Kruistal functions as a museum housing, three exhibition spaces, an auditorium, and a restaurant. The building successfully houses all five spaces in only 3,300 square meters of space and is therefore a very compact design. The south side of the Kunstall is bordered by a busy street on a dike and the north side by the museum park, which is situated lower than the building itself. The building was designed as four independent pieces that were joined together by a continuous promenade that forms a spiral. Sloping floor planes and well-organized ramps allow a seamless transition between the busy highway and the network of museums of Museum Park. The Kunsthal was the first large project that OMA designed and built. Kuhlhaas's work in general, and specifically on the Kunsthal, vigorously attempts to embrace the differences between architecture and urban design, which have struggled to keep a level of material honesty, human scale, and careful craft and meaning in a world that adopts materiality, scale of machine, and random meaning. Kuhlhaas does an excellent job of constituting singular, identifiable, and commanding forms. These forms just barely enclose many practices, paths of circulation, and spatial networking. Furthermore, in architecture, working with juxtaposition, especially in materiality, details and construction can create new meanings out of rather ordinary and pedestrian substances. This building, as Jane Rendell states, was perhaps one of the first to disturb the logic of inside and outside, artificial and man-made, by positioning, for example, tree trunks as columns inside the building. When Kuhlhaas clad the facades of his Kunsthal, in Rotterdam with roofing felt and uses trashy corrugated plastic panels in the interior. He does it with the didactic intention of deconstructing the museum as a shrine to art. What makes the Kunsthal so successful as an architecture piece is that Kuhlhaas defies what many architects have set out to create. He uses almost boring objects and turns them into the most brilliant composition, all the while destroying the classic idea of a museum.